I thought I would never have to make this video. What's up you guys? Chad Guthrie the Dream Poet here coming to you all with what was supposed to be day 103 of my vlogging experience here in the state of Florida. Well, for whatever reason, until I can get this whole stupid thing figured out, day 103 is on this phone right here. And if y'all kept up with me in the last few vlogs, especially with day 102, I also said I was having or technical difficulties. Well, it was this piece of garbage right here. And last few days, I've been trying to keep it charged with this. But for whatever weird, strange reason, it just wouldn't pick up a charge. Then it would pick up a charge. And now it's not picking up any charge. And the thing is dead. And I'm stuck with a, a dead phone. So, until I can get this situation settled, it's, it's all on here. But, I, I don't recommend, I really don't recommend Droid. Get yourself another type of phone. These things are garbage. They're very cheaply made. They break within six months of you owning them. They're, they're not a good investment. And that's all I'm saying. This is totally ridiculous. This should not be a problem. But yet, it is. And yet, they keep producing these phones. And this company has been sued multiple times before. But I'm surprised how it has even managed to stay above the waterline. Like, what keeps it going? I'm very aggravated. I'm very frustrated. It's a garbage phone. Get yourself something. Do not get a Samsung Galaxy. They're they're just not worth it. Like the situation that I'm dealing with now. So now that I have ranted and vented, I wanted to tell you all what happened for today. Today started off a course. I told you all about the technological problems that I was having but we went to work and after we went to work I went got things uploaded and then we got to see some of the other headstones out at the Lofton Cemetery I found another entrance it looks like somebody's been feeding the cats there the feral cats um, I might have to tell the uh, my boss about that um, but and that's another thing too I will probably be doing another 3 a.m. challenge in the future my boss has given me permission to do that you see my boss her family owns that cemetery and some of those headstones go all the way back to like the late 1700s like if you have seen what the graveyards and the cemetery looks like in St. Augustine it's the exact same thing it's ex of the exact same period everything and it's really pretty and it's really gorgeous but there are some headstones or I should say some vegetation that has grown over in one part of the video we saw this this longleaf pine growing straight up out of the ground and you can see the headstone moving all the way to the side it, it, it was crazy and I found a doll too that it just all too reminded me of, of, of Annabelle stood away from it and I think tomorrow we're gonna go out there I figure why not I mean it's a new vlog it's a new day you know but ooh, just today would have been a really good overall vlog you guys but I'm excited I also have the opportunity now to get another phone granted that's probably gonna be down the line a little bit um, burn myself at work that uh, that was a lot of fun trying to 
grab it and hot grease and yeah I mean it's not the end of the world I mean I just I just burned myself and yeah kind of kind of hurts so also went to Ace Hardware came to a very sad sad conclusion that all the popcorn was gone and yeah that that kind of made me a little bit sad I'm not going to lie to that but still also I found a golf ball I know that's really not a whole lot of news but still walking across the San Jose Boulevard smacking it on the ground and watching it as it, it, it just kind of losing control and watching it go to like somewhere totally else nobody got hurt nobody wrecked I just think it's kind of funny and I think this would have made a good part of the vlog but near the end of the day we were at Mandarin Park and I came across what I thought was a lady's purse I mean I got and I looked through to maybe see if there was some kind of identification but it looked like it was just a little girl's uh, storage bag what do you want to call it I mean I left it you know and again tomorrow we will probably go over there I, I mean I'll show you all if if all of it's even there um, but yeah just overall thank you all for staying in touch with me and staying posted um, and to this has not been my night period um, there was a other video like this but again doesn't work got a lot of static and yeah it's it's just not been my night but thankfully tomorrow is a new day an exciting day and I don't have to put up with this um, probably payday I will probably take this garbage phone into Walmart and we'll see if I can't get it fixed we'll see if I can't get this footage out there or I might just have to wait till I get a new phone I'm thinking about purchasing a used iPhone off of one of my co-workers and probably that would just be the better route um, I have purchased an iPhone before but my experience with it is it wasn't all that great in fact there was a point where the thing wouldn't even operate and I, 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 I kind of threw it on the ground um, but yeah not, not a good part of uh, history my history there but, but yeah that's 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 just been my day today has not been my day this has been totally ridiculous get yourself a phone go to like Metro PCS or go to Verizon but not droid droid does not make a good brand I love you guys so I'm tired tomorrow's a new day tomorrow is day 104 of my blogging experience here in the state of Florida and I thank all 93 of you so far that have decided to take this journey with me so don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon that will put you in a chance to win a $50 Walmart gift card as well as the first ever Dream Poet t-shirt. But there is more. You also have two additional chances to win two, two additional t-shirts as well as two framed photos of mine that I will never be printing again. Um, I believe in the links below. I may attach my Etsy to give you all an idea of what my portfolio looks like or you could even check my Instagram. So Stay posted, stay tuned, keep in touch with me at Dream Poet at Facebook, as well as my Instagram, in the links below. Thank you all for the love and support. I love you all very much. Peace, you guys.